Brian Jade Warriors, Isaac here, and guys, welcome back! Yes, it's time for us to kick off 2013 proper with some actual gameplay. Before we get started though, I just wanted to say hello once again to all my awesome Jade Warriors. Thank you so much guys for requesting more Tokyo Jungle, requesting more videos in general. Because all of you, every single one of my awesome Jade Warriors was deep down in my heart during my vacation in Australia. And I'm going to tell you all about my vacation today as we get started with another playthrough of Tokyo Jungle. So, let's jump into survival. Let's get a new game started single player she is and we have had requests for the robo dog but today guys truth be told i made a little bit of a pig of myself while i was in australia man it had been so long it had been six years guys since i tucked into some you know beefy meat pies and fish and chips and kangaroo steak that i went a bit overboard and i put on a couple of kilos as I'm sure you can tell from my quadruple chin, but that doesn't matter, does it, guys? As long as you're healthy and happy, that's the most important thing as always. But, you know, seeing as I'm embracing the pig in me at the moment, I thought we might as well get the playthrough for the pig over and done with, as it were. So without further ado, let's jump on in and see what our four-legged friend is all about and how efficient that snout of his is. Let's see if he can actually smell out all those drugs that they tried to smuggle through the airports. Because I tell ya, no one's smuggling drugs through Ma Shibuya. No one's getting past Ma Station. And to be honest, I'm going to guess he's a herbivore, but he could possibly be a carnivore. Let's find out. Oh, eat my, my pig titties, I guess. I just threw my breast to that chicken's face. Suck my milk! Suck my milk! <laughs> oh my god, we're off to a great, sensible, and mature start to the year, aren't we, guys? Yay! <laughs> there we go, I guess that proves it. I guess we are a herbivore, so we're going to have to start eating our way through this playthrough. And as we do, guys, as we get stuck into our first little vegetarian buffet how you all been i hope you've all been really really well this year guys so far that is it i know it hasn't been that long but i hope every single day has been really special and a ton of fun guys because i know mine have i've been having a blast in australia so pretty much again i apologize to everyone i didn't have enough time to even <laughs> do a proper farewell video at the end of last year because I was literally throwing things in my suitcase as I was running out the door to get to the airport. And it just, it seriously blew me away that my sister and my parents had no internet connection. I was without the internet for pretty much three weeks straight. It was very, very, uh, kind of a rude awakening, especially considering how all of us are very, very comfortable living in a digital age these days, guys. So I was kind of a bit shell shocked by that but you know every cloud has a silver lining i did uh, get make the most out of it as much as i could because yeah i went all over the place uh really caught up with my families you, you know it's been six years and i couldn't believe how you know accomplished my sisters had become i was very very proud of them especially my baby sister if you're watching this, sis, I love you. You're absolutely awesome. I can't believe how, you know, well you've done for yourself in a matter of six short years. And I just know the next time I visit won't be that long. It'll be much, much sooner than that. And I know you will have accomplished another helping of awesome in that time. But anyway, I digress. I first visited, well, I guess I'll, I'll give you guys the full rundown. If you guys are here, watch me play a pig i'm guessing you're also you know semi interested in hearing me rant about my holiday so that's what i'm going to do today as i jump on top of a this what kind of clinic is this nose clinic nose clinic i guess that's where our pig needs to go he needs to go to a nose clinic there's something wrong with my nose i gotta get it cleaned out come on doctor Ah, uh, doctor must be out. But anyway, <laughs> uh, uh, I had a great, great time uh, uh, getting there until I actually got to the country. That is. So what I did, I took a flight from, <clears throat> I took a flight from Tokyo Narita Airport, 
to Cairns, then Cairns to Brisbane, then Brisbane to Mackay. Unfortunately, as I was taking the cheapest Jetstar line available, ew, just like this, this P female here is as cheap as they possibly get. Unfortunately, the, uh, yeah, the, uh, service isn't immaculate, no. I ended up having to, uh, wait in Cairns for six hours due to a cancelled flight. And, yeah, it just didn't get any better from there, really. Because I ended up missing my flight in Brisbane, and I ended up getting to my sister's house many an hour after my appointed arrival time. But, you know, you get that. Stuff happens, not always in the order you'd expect. So I apologize guys, I'm ranting here, I'm ranting away and I'm not actually sure where I'm heading. Yeah, look at that, there's absolutely nothing for a pig like me in Dog and Zucker. We need ourselves a lot more foods. So seeing as I've already completed the objective to to uh, uh, go to Dog and Zucker, I might as well just start heading in the other direction. I was hoping to eat a bit of food. Pardon me, I was hoping to uh, eat a bit of food in Dog and Zucker, level myself up, get down and nasty with that average female we found in the south of Dog and Zucker, but that's just not going to happen because there ain't no any food. I'm already starving to death for crying out loud and the game's just begun. Oh game, why do you hate me so? Please, please be my friend. Present me more flowers, please. Take me on a couple more dates. Show me what it's like to be loved. Please, game. And then we'll switch roles and I'll return the favor. Oh, I can't eat chicken, game. Come on. Man. All right, we're heading into the shopping district to see what we can find. All right, so. <clears throat> anyway. Finally got, oh, more piggies. Hello, piggies. Hello, Sue. Arnie, Sue, how you going? And Bob! Hey, Uncle Bob! How you two going there? Got any Christmas presents for me? I didn't see you in Australia when we had the family reunion. Gotta give me some presents now. Make up for it, no? Oh, cheap bastards. Oh, shit! Ah! Silky Terrors on my ass! And was that a cheater? Cheesy, maneezy. I think that was a cheetah already, or something that looks very ferocious. Yes, what a- ah! It was a hyena! Ah! Give me a break, I only just started playing the cat! I'm not dead! I'm not dead, I swear to you, I'm not dead! Oh, you son- no, I'm not dead yet! I <laughs> oh, game, why do you hate me so? Oh my god. Well, it has been about a month since I played me some Tokyo Jungle Guys, so I guess it's to be expected. <laughs> oh, sigh. Oh, uh, well, that's okay. We can jump straight back in, can't we, gang? Yeah, that sounds about right. 34,493rd. Why was there a TH there? That should have been an RD. I don't know. Anyway, let's get back in there. Let's start ourselves another game. Oh, goodness gracious me. It's my own fault. I should have dressed him up in drag before we headed out. As usual, I, you know, I underestimated the severity of this game. And how it likes to harass me. And not shower me in flowers like it promised. Stupid game. Anyway, let's get some clothes on this fella. Yep, it's freaking freezing here in Tokyo right now, guys. We had really, really heavy snow on Monday. And it's been a week, but it's still... <laughs> That's awesome. I look good enough to eat. All the snow is still hanging on the ground. It's absolutely crazy. So, there we go. We've got ourselves some duds. We're looking really nice. We want to be able to get this, so we have to complete two challenges and change generations over one time. I think we can manage that. And we have to touch the Black Buck boss, which happens after... Oh, before 30 years. Before 30 years. Okay, we are on it. Don't you worry, game. I'm going to keep my, my eye open, keeping an eye on the event status of each zone to make sure that... 
boss doesn't get away from us. No, I definitely want to unlock as many animals as possible, guys. Guy, guys. <laughs> I want to pretty much, I want to start playing this game exclusively for the time being, at least until I can finish unlocking all the animals. I feel last year I had a lot of fun with the channel, guys, but I think I spread myself far, far, far too thin. Just with my time constraints, I had a grand plan, but it just did not come to fruition. I just did not- OH SHIT! HE'S ALIVE! HE'S ALIVE! Oh my god! Oh, don't kill me! Oh my god, I'm hiding! I'm hiding! <laughs> but yes, I had a grand plan, guys, to be able to manage a few hours of recording, at least every two to three days, but unfortunately it was just really, really difficult with my work schedule. So, this year, I'm not going to spread myself over several games at once. I'm only going to do one at a maximum two at a time until they're completely done. And yeah, I'll just keep uh, uploading them daily as much as possible. I think I can, if I do this, if I just stick to one series at a time, I'm pretty sure I can upload on a daily basis. At least 10 minutes worth. So I can keep you guys entertained as much as possible. You know, seeing as you guys take the time to watch my craziness, I have to at least comply in some insignificant way. If that makes sense. Not really. I'm just talking out my buttocks at the moment while I snack down on this grass. Hey, there we go. Anyway, <laughs> while our stylish Drew Barrymore walks down the streets. Did I just call Drew Barrymore a pig? I think I did. I'm sorry, Drew Barrymore. You're adorable. I love you. But <laughs> as our styling... <laughs> who's, who's, who's a fashionable fat person in in the world today. Nothing is coming to mind right now. I'm not even sure hmm, who would classify as an attractive fat person. Hmm. Certainly not one that we could, you know, graciously compare to a pig. Ah, shit! I just used all my stamina, leave me alone! Don't, don't! I had no stamina, you bitch! Holy fuck! What the fucking shit is that? Ah! Ah! Uh, was that as good for you as it was for me? That was pretty good. Oh my god. What is going on? Ah, another change for this, you guys. I'm going to be swearing a lot more. Like, I was trying to keep it PG-13 as much as possible, but fuck it. I'm just going to be myself. Swear whenever it feels appropriate, because... I don't want to censor myself because it stifles my, you know, originality and my creativity, especially with joke telling. So it's just going to be raw Zach from here on out, guys. And I hope you like your raw foods because I know I do. Mm -mm. A nice helping of raw sushi always does my innards good. Piggy, 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 piggy. I got to sit you down, boy. Like this is the third time I'm playing you and, you know, your brother, your first brother, he had the straw house. He failed me. He failed me, dude. Your second brother, he had the wood house. And, you know, he, he was... He put a lot of effort into building that thing. But it still... It was no good. But I know... I know you, Piggy. Piggy, you are my bro in the brick house. You are going to withstand the test of time. At least a couple of hours worth of your, your life's time in this playthrough. So please, Piggy. Please, 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 Piggy. Don't blow it. Don't blow it. Leave that job to the wolf that's gonna, you know, probably eat your corpse while you're still alive. Yes, you're gonna be a living corpse. A zombie pig. That'd be interesting. Oh, they should have zombie animals. Oh, guys at Sony, if you're still got... You know, the, the original code for this game, please make a zombie animal expansion pack. That would make my day, my life, my, you know, my entire lineage complete. It really would. 